Hi my lovelies, welcome back to my channel and for everybody who is new, I'm Liora and I'm so glad you found me. So welcome to today's video which is of course as always on Wednesdays, you know it, new makeup releases mostly of the indie world, mostly colorful because uh, I think that's an obvious one and if you've just found me, I'm Liora, makeup artist and stylist living for colorful makeup and colorful styling so if that is something that is intriguing to you that you've always wanted to look into get inspired or just hang out then you're at the right place I'm so so happy you're here please subscribe be part of my channel it doesn't cost you anything it makes me incredibly happy and this is just the perfect match right okay beyond that of course I have also all my social media linked in the description box down below so you can get more inspired I have a page for styling I have a page for makeup and something super super new I also now have a page for Rex who is my German Shepherd puppy so he has his own Instagram now so if you're into that then you'll also find the link down below okay uh, sweetie so we have a lot to uh, dive into because um, there is so much nice stuff this time that I just need to talk about it try to stop me okay but wait before we go into this I need to tell you what I have on my face because that is what I'm doing I'm telling you what I have on my face so I don't have to list everything so I'm just going to tell you that I am today wearing the blood moon palette from when Day Cosmetics which looks like this. I received this in PR together with the whole Alchemy bundle and I used three shades of the Alchemy bundle today which are these three. So this is like a reddish one, this is the shade Cinnabar, this is the shade Alchemy, this is more a purple one and this is the shade Liv wait, Lixiviate. I think. <laughs> so this is from Wednesday Cosmetics and I think a review is coming up. This is my second look now. So uh, we shall see about that. Okay, sweeties, now that uh, we spoke about that, let us go right into the new makeup releases because again, there is so much nice stuff that I definitely want to talk to you about. I again have a lot of problems with my internet. It is just so, so weak down here these days. It has never been good, but like recently it is very, very bad. So I hope I'm going to manage. So in any case, let's just move to the side and let us start with uh, Saints Angel Sinners because they're actually sneak peeking or kind of showing us a new palette and that is a quad and this one here is the Saints Angel Sinners Cares palette. This is a duochrome palette with four chrome shades and all proceeds are going to an autoimmune disease association. I don't know which one, I don't know if there are many, I have no idea but this is of course super super nice. I am very very grateful that Darcy the owner is such a loving and giving person it's so so nice so this is now available for pre-order and this retails for $25 all right sweeties then we also definitely need to talk about a new palette and that is the collab we have spoken about this palette at least twice already here and then you make up releases because I've always shown you I think we started with the outer packaging and then I've shown you like updates which I do because I love to talk about makeup so uh, this is of course the palette in collaboration with gourmand girls cosmetics with Christina who is also a friend and Darcy is a friend and these two are also friends and that's why they collabed and this is the palette that they are coming out with together and I have to say sweeties like seriously this is so so cute such a beautiful palette first of all it's my heart that it is a bigger palette. This of course has 15 shades and I think this is absolutely beautiful. You see that as of when I'm filming this, the shade in the middle, in the middle row in the middle, this one is still missing. But maybe by the time you're seeing this, which is a day later, this will be revealed and maybe I'm going to include it then next week again and show you the final picture. But this is what it is. I think it's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. There's a super nice balance in the palette and of course I personally really want to see the last shade so I wonder what that is I wonder what it is I have no idea it could go in any direction so that is really really cool okay so this is of course from Saints Angel Sinners and this is then going to come super super soon okay so uh, we are going to talk about that obviously again okay then I also wanted to talk about Makeup Revolution who is collaborating with Coca-Cola and they're coming out with this or it's basically inspired by by Coca-Cola let's put it that way okay it says here it's inspired by the new space flavor intergalactic Galactic, whatever that means. I have not been drinking cola for 10 years, so I have no idea. I'm not following things like this. I only drink water and coffee and once in a while a glass of wine. That is all, <laughs> you know, so that's why I don't know. But in any case, uh, this is what it is. Now, color scheme, it is kind of a, a safe 
safe summer palette. Um, of course, there's a bigger palette and also a mini palette. And then there's also a highlighter, a cosmetic bag. There's um, lip products and also a mascara. Um, but the thing is that all of these are shimmer shades. All of these are shimmer shades, I think. As far as I can see here from the picture, it looks like all of these palettes, also the big one and also the small ones, are like all of them are shimmer shades, which makes it absolutely very hard to use for me. I'm just not into it. But um, yeah, so this is what it is. So <laughs> just wanted to show you in case you want to check this one out, this should already be live. Then we also need to talk about this one here from Melt. Now, I know that they came out with like a whole kind of a collection like this beforehand and I think if I understand this right this is just like an additional shade or additional shades to the sex foil liquid highlight in 10 lines collection now um, I still don't know what sex has to do with this does one turn into foiled a foiled thing when I don't know I really don't maybe I've been doing it wrong all those years sweeties <laughs> Have I been wrong all those years? Okay, so in any case, I don't understand the connection. I don't know what this is supposed to mean besides that it sells well, you know, besides that, I really don't know. But uh, this should already be available when you're seeing this. I think this went live here yesterday, which is my today. Okay, so maybe, I don't know, let us know in the comments what you think about this. I'm just so sick and tired of using um, sex for selling stuff. I'm just so over it. Am I too old? <laughs> Be kind. Okay, sweeties, let's talk about ColourPop because they're coming out with the, what is it called again? They're coming out with the Palm Springs collection. Okay, so this is going to become available your tomorrow. There is going to be an eyeshadow palette for $18 and then also three Super Shock highlighters for $8 each and lip glosses and gel liners and all kinds of stuff. Okay, sweeties, um, this is of course, um, again, also sort of a sunset kind of a palette minus the the purple <laughs> but in any case it has nice depth in the palette but overall this is too flat for me um, I can't just not do enough because the the overwhelming color scheme is just into this orange terracotta thing and I just don't want to do looks like that like all the time you know so this is not gonna be for me but maybe it is for you then definitely check it out okay you might be hearing my dog uh, who is I think whimpering upstairs because he wants to come down to me <laughs> okay sweeties um, we also need to talk about Kylie Cosmetics she is collaborating with uh, Stassi now I don't know Stassi I think on her Instagram it says Anastasia something something I don't know her I don't really know Kylie either <laughs> so whatever you know but in any case this this is the uh, Best Friends Forever collab between those two and apparently they're very very close. I did look at the Stassi's uh, Instagram account. All I know is that um, she has big boobs and she has a butt. I don't know what else she has going for herself. <laughs> Sorry I'm a bit sassy here but it's just you know when I was looking at this and I cannot pull it up now because of my slow internet. I'm just like recalling it from memory. Um, the thing is, when I'm looking at these things, uh, from my advanced age of almost 43, I just feel like, what, how, how do you live? How do you, how do you grow older um, when this is all you have to define yourself? <laughs> I don't know, you know? So I don't know because all of these things will fade and at some point you cannot sell yourself like this anymore and then what? Then what? You open a restaurant, maybe. I don't know, but okay. So let's talk about the um, the collection. The collection is obviously not made for me. This is not for me. Okay, there is nice depth. At least there is that darker brown and then there's also a medium brown in there. So that is okay. Um, it is just not, absolutely not um, what I would like to work with because it is just overall, even the colorful shades are just too baby pink and baby blue. It's just not, not for me. This is too soft for me. So beyond the palette, there's also going to be a pressed illuminating powder. There's going to be two liquid eyeliner pens, um, a liquid lipstick and lip liners, a high gloss duo set, and of course the palette. Okay, so if that is something that you would want to pick up, then uh, please do so. <laughs> okay, sweeties, let us talk about another sneak peek from Nomad, because of course you know that I have been, I think for the last three weeks, been speaking about the new collection coming from Nomad cosmetics I don't know if by the time that I am releasing this video if the destination is already um, 
obvious. <laughs> I don't know, but this is the newest thing. This is, of course, a lippy. I own this whole collection. I got that in PR already some time ago. So you're going to, of course, see a video about this this collection here. Um, I don't know anything about the launch date yet because there has been a bit of a delay, uh, but that is what it is. So uh, we are definitely going to keep talking about this. So this is coming soonish from Nomad Cosmetics. All right, then let's also talk about Sugar Drizzle because Sugar Drizzle is coming out with the Sugar Dreams eyeshadow palette. This is a nine pen palette. This is a full pastel duochrome and special shimmers palette. I'm not 100% sure what it means special shimmers but it's something special. Yeah so that is what it is. This is coming soon. I do not have a price and I don't have a date. This is of course a very very soft. I'm kind of super glad for this lime green um, shade there in the middle. It kind of makes the palette you know. This is what brings the oomph to the palette and I think that is also a secret that Sugar Drizzle just really really masters well. That um, they're, they're putting colors together. There is always like an edge an unexpected edge to it and this is what makes it interesting and this is what draws my eyes to it and I really really like this. Now is this going to be particularly for me? Maybe not but that is okay you know not everything has to be for me I still love the brand you know this is not a criticism it's just that not everything needs to be for me but beyond that I think they did a super well, a good job and I think it looks super pretty. Okay then let's also talk about Sydney Grace because they're releasing brushes and I just definitely wanted to show you because I love eyeshadow brushes. So you do have 14 brushes total and um, I think you can get them in sets and also as single brushes. These are cruelty free, they're synthetic brushes, they have wooden handles and um, this is becoming available on the 16th. These 14 brushes are basically two sets. One set is the face brushes and one set is the eye brushes. The face brushes will retail for $50 and then the eye set will retail for $55. Okay, so that is basically what it is and with that let's move on to Mira Beauty because of course I spoke about the release or the upcoming collection basically last week already and maybe even the week before because they are collaborating with Devereaux Banks and now I can show you the palette. So this is how she looks. I think this is a very very beautiful palette. It really encaptures also what is on the outside of the packaging which is really really well done. It looks beautiful and uh, this is the Divine palette. Now it has eight shimmers and four mattes and this is becoming available on the 17th of this month. Now um, I don't have a price unfortunately right here but I'm sure you can figure that one out. Um, for me personally for my makeup style I would prefer to have eight mattes and four shimmers like the opposite you know. So for me this is too shimmer heavy um, so this is this is not going to be for me even though I think that it is super super beautiful and definitely also check out Devereaux Banks because he is absolutely talented and amazing the makeup he's doing. You know, he's a big, big artist and I, I love that. I love to look at beautiful things and talented people and, and all of that. So now this in particular is not going to be for me, but I have tried Mira Beauty and I love Mira Beauty. It's a very, very special brand and very dear to my heart. And uh, definitely check out this release in case you do like to have a lot of shimmers in a palette and also like darker shimmers and stuff. So definitely check this one out. Okay, sweeties, then let's also talk about Enslay Rain Cosmetics again because last time we spoke about the Pastel Dreams eyeshadow palette, but there is more to this collection. Okay, so let me just read this for you. It says here, embrace the dreamy pastel trend with this stunning palette featuring 16 of the prettiest pastel hues needed to create endless looks from soft glam to bold and daring. So you do have 16 shades in this palette, 8 mattes, 8 shimmers. This retails for $29. Then you also do have the Rainbow Multi liquid eyeshadows which you can also see here in the picture. They come in of course all of those colors. They retail for $19 each or $149 for the bundle and then you also do have the rain or shine lip glosses. Also in all of the colors that you hopefully will be able to see here, $18 each or $130 for the whole bundle. And then you also do have the Multichrome Moon Dust in all of these shades for $16 each or $118 for the bundle. All of this is available now. There are discount codes available. I don't have one, but uh, you'll find them of course on Instagram. Um, yeah, so this is of course a very, very, very cohesive collection. They're really staying true to the theme and that 
that is really really nice I'm personally not blown away by pastels at all though and that also I said uh, last week that this palette gives you the oomph and this is also what they're saying here you can go bold and you can go light and that is really really nice so you do not have to commit to one thing because like really I can't I can't commit to one thing you know but also all the additional things you know like also the lippies look beautiful and uh, liquid eyeshadow is not so much my thing because I just um, don't vibe so much with something liquid on my eyelids because I'm not you know 16 but looks beautiful you know so if this is something that you would like to try then definitely do so this is available now from Inslay Rain Cosmetics we should also talk about metamorphosis because they're coming out with the mesmerizing collection this collection includes the mesmerizing eyeshadow palette for $20 then also eyelashes for $8 and the mesmerizing eyeliner for $8 this is available now okay sweeties I think this is a really really cute palette it kind of has at least from what I'm seeing here right now this has the jewel tones which is really really lovely I love to have these kinds of shades on my eyes there's beautiful depth in the palette the swatches look amazing uh, from what I can see here these these shimmer shades look absolutely or some of them at least look absolutely foiled and beautiful so uh, that is what I can say to this you know um, that is what it is so this is available now in case you want to check this one out from metamorphosis Uoma Beauty is coming out with the drip and smooth powders for $29.50 50 in different shades and then also the trip in smooth primer for $29 now this is available now I am so so intrigued by this brand I have not a lot of this brand I do have I think two lip liners and a lipstick but what I have from this brand is so so good now can I judge anything really from those products that I have not really I would love to find out how the eyeshadow formula is if you know please let me know that would be so so interesting but also loose powders is super super interesting to me because I always use loose powders I do not ever really use pressed powders so that is really really cool and primers sweeties super important for any makeup application that is supposed to be like professional a primer is a must and if you want to have staying power a primer is a must so this is a very very smart release I think it looks really really good and that is basically all I know so definitely check this one out in case you want to then we should also talk about Pat McGrath because she's coming out with a mini eyeshadow palette which is called Midnight Voyage and it says you're a mini mirrored eyeshadow compact inspired by Pat's most loved shades and textures okay so this retails for $29 and this is a limited edition I think this is how I understand the post okay um, nice depth within those six shades so I have to give her that beyond that I think it is three mattes or two mattes and then four shimmers or three shimmers it's a bit hard to see right now is it I think it's two mattes and four shimmers that is again very very hard for me personally to use because I'm just very very committed to my makeup style but um, um, yeah so that is what it is in case you want to check this one out I think it is nice that it is dark that I really really love you know but uh, that is basically all I can say <laughs> I can say to that okay let's talk about dandelions cosmetics because they are coming out with their spirit singles you will have seven shades four dollars fifty a piece or thirty dollars for the bundle and you know what this is already available when you're seeing this this is very very bright and uh, happy so in case you want to check this one out this looks like it's all mattes all right so definitely check this one out from dandelions then we definitely sweeties need to talk about something that really really blew me away and because I have a very long going going back a long time relationship with that brand kind of a romance with that brand I definitely need to make a big deal out of this one because this is jolly beauty sweeties look at this one Jolie Beauty is releasing their Ethereality collection now I have to say that this palette is coming my way uh, one of my besties sponsored this one um, after the fact I saw that there is more to it than just the palette now I'm very grateful for the palette the palette retails for $58 it has 28 shades sweeties I have all of her palettes of Jolie's palettes that are in that design you know I have I think three I want to say three could be wrong but I think the three previous ones ever since she started to make these palettes I have all of them okay I love them I love them they're so so beautiful I highly recommend this brand to you yeah 
so that is what it is then there is also going to be a uh, multi-chrome liquid shadows there's also going to be four matte lipsticks and all of that so there's also going to be bundle versions and all of that this is all now available for pre-order so i don't know when i'm going to get my palette but um this is beautiful i just love how jolie puts her palettes together there is always there's always something new you know maybe not like new to the world we spoke about this last time there is nothing really new you can come up with but she's always doing it in such a tasteful way also check out her palettes that she comes out during halloween you know her fall releases they are always stunning always different always edgy beautiful you know this is a beautiful brand definitely so definitely check this one out this is absolutely Leora approved but i have to say i only checked out her eyeshadow formula all of the other items that she has i have not tried yet but the eyeshadow eyeshadow formula I really really like. Okay sweeties let's also talk about She Glam because uh, She Glam is coming out with the Be Bold Be Hue hue collection okay so we do have the eyeshadow palette with 12 shades six matte six shimmers for nine dollars you do have a highlighter for six dollars and then an eyeliner pen set with five shades for twelve dollars this is available now and they will be donating fifty thousand dollars to the Trevor project fifty thousand 50k wow that is that's significant okay so um that is the palette in case you want to check this one out of course you see you do have basically a matte shade and then always a corresponding shimmer shade to it um if that's something you want to check out beyond that that's what it is it's affordable makeup i really really like that i have tried the eyeshadow formula from she glam it was okay it was not like super super spectacular but it was okay you know so and i think it's a very very good thing uh, when stuff is available also for people who cannot spend 60 dollars for an eyeshadow palette right okay sweeties let's talk about xno cosmetics because they're coming out with the queen bee eyeshadow palette now i've read in the comments of this post that uh, people couldn't find it on the website i don't know what the situation will be in case you look now so please feel free to check this one out or contact the brand in case you can find it but according to my information this is available now for $28 you do have nine shades six of them are mattes and three of them are shimmers which is my perfect ratio it's just perfect like this also the theme is beautiful there is nice depth in the palette i cannot 100 percent see right now here what the difference between those dark shades is i'm sure there is one black and one super super dark brown um maybe there is a second brown that is then a shimmer it's a bit hard for me to see right now here on the picture and again i cannot scroll around much because my feed doesn't update because of the low internet uh, availability but in any case you will find it and you will check it out in case you wish to do so this is available now maybe hopefully for $28 then let's talk about gourmand girls cosmetics because this palette the radioactive palette is available now it has 12 shades they're all dual chromes and this is already on the way to me so I'm definitely going to show this to you I think it looks beautiful the outer packaging is super super stunning and also the inside is really really beautiful I cannot wait to get my fingers on this so that is coming to my channel and also of course to my social media so please follow me there as well okay then then let's also talk about Eternal Fire Cosmetics. This is, I think, a new brand for me. And they're coming out with the Eternal Eyeshadow Palette with nine shades. This has six mattes and three shimmers, which is, again, super nice. This is my, my sweet spot when it comes to nine pan palettes. This is my, my most favorite ratio that you can give me. <laughs> you know so this retails for $25 then there's also going to be the infinity lip gloss for $15 and the timeless liquid lipstick for $15 and this is available now this brand is vegan and cruelty free in case you want to check this one out and uh, you can see that this palette has a potential for being like super super fiery you can go super super bold with this and really when you think about it with you know this this soft golden shimmer that is in the top right corner and and then the shade that is in the bottom right corner you can also go really really soft you know sometimes there are like hidden looks in a palette and you think the overall look is like super bombastic and like really really vibrant but sometimes you know there is really options also for other looks in it in case that is something you want to do so that is what it is feel free to check this one out eternal fire cosmetics all right sweeties then let's also talk about lorella cosmetics because they're collaborating with 
with Ongina. They're coming out with the Life is a Celebration uh, collab and this palette is a two-in-one. It has 18 eyeshadows and two face products and it retails for $45. Now, uh, sweeties, this looks really, really nice. You have, of course, a softer side and then a more vibrant side. You do have, of course, bronzers and then also a blush and a highlighter in the palette in case that is something that you would like to check out. I I don't know what to tell you about Ongina. I don't know uh, what to say because I need to be unfortunately so so careful so I don't get monetized because it has already happened before that I called someone a she because I thought that it is a she but then she considers herself as a he and then my video got taken down without even me being notified because you know people make mistakes and how can I always know what everybody is you know it's just really really confusing this world so I don't want to say too much unfortunately because I, I just don't want to because I don't want to do all this work and then my video gets taken down for one wrong word you know so that's why I'm just gonna stay out of it but you see the person I hope people still consider themselves as people because I really don't know but the this is the person and I hope with that I'm safe. Okay, sweeties, but this is the a Life is a Celebration palette. Really, really nice range of everything. You get everything in this palette and I've tried Lorella Cosmetics and uh, for me, the, the formula absolutely works. So definitely check this one out in case you want to. We should also talk about Cosmetic Cosmetics because they are collaborating with Pen D Replay. And uh, this is the palette that they came out with together. First of all, outer packaging, top notch super super cool artwork really really loving it and then of course you do have the palette which is also really really pretty with that really nice dark blue there in the corner I love that that makes the palette for me you can of course use that blue to like oomph up every single look in this palette in case you wish to do so and that is so so cool so this is becoming available on June 19th congratulations to this beautiful palette and I'm so so happy that they're coming out with another cool release all right then let's also talk about Sakura Moon Beauty because I definitely wanted to show you this one this is a palette this is called Enchanted Lake eyeshadow palette and this is a palette that has nine shades five pressed glitters and four shimmers I wanted to show you this because because I think the color scheme is actually super super cool and what they did here which is kind of similar not really similar but I kind of get also the vibes of that palette that we just saw in the beginning of the video from Sugar Drizzle because also here is in the middle this shade this kind of greenish shade which just makes the palette you know I think this is really really pretty okay now you have to be into of course pressed glitters if you are not then this is not for you but this retails for $16 and it's now available for pre-order and you know with a palette like this you can just add a nice sparkle to your collection even if you're usually not buying stuff like this but you know to just have an add-on to another palette where you think you know there's a little sparkle missing then just add a palette like this and then you're you're good you know so this is what it is unfortunately I cannot tell you how the binder is um, of the formula I don't know but uh, this is how it looks and of course you also see the swatches so this is available now for pre-order in case you want to check this one out then I also definitely wanted to talk to you about uh, this one and that is from Profusion. They're coming out with a limited edition collaboration with Jurassic World. Okay, so this is a whole big collection. I kind of want to focus on the eyeshadow palette because that is the most important thing for me. <laughs> okay, so Profusion is um, formula-wise not my favorite, but I really, really support, of course, affordable makeup. So that is, of course, um, that's something that I do because I absolutely believe in that. I think the whole idea is really, really nice. I think there should probably be a little bit more purple because the outside of the packaging is just way more purple. <laughs> I don't know. I just vibe this way. But overall, this is a very, very earthy palette and kind of quiet. You know, there is basically if you would take out that very, very um, orange terracotta shade that is there towards the middle, um, it would be a super, super quiet palette for my taste. 
you know so that is what it is in case you want to check this one out this palette has 38 shades it retails for $25 and then you have all kinds of other stuff it's a huge huge collection in case you want to check this one out all right then let's talk about freaking fabulous cosmetics because they're coming out with the Arabian Nights multi-chrome eyeshadow palette definitely wanted to show you I unfortunately do not have swatches right here but this is how she looks and with palettes like this you can only see really with swatches what you're getting because like here you could get the impression that it's basically more or less the same shade in nine pans but it's not you know because that is just not happening but uh, this is how it looks I think this has the potential of being super super beautiful and uh, definitely check it out in case you want to add something like that to your collection all right sweeties we are almost at an end we need to talk about crown noir cosmetics and they're coming out with the I am palette which has 18 shades 14 mattes which is hmm, three high shine shimmers and one multi-dimensional glitter and this is uh, becoming alive on your today I think let me just double check yes your today this is becoming alive from crown noir cosmetics I think this is a very very nice summer palette beautiful depth in the palette and of course it kind of has the sunset color scheme you also see of course on the looks that they're giving you there as an example super super beautiful you can go in all kinds of different directions and it's it's very very pretty also the swatches look good so in case you want to check this one out this is becoming available right now all right then creature cosmetics labs is coming out with a <laughs> this one and I got tagged in this one you guys are so so sweet so they're coming out with the monster baby palettes each one is a two pan mini palette in a coffin shaped palette it's a coffin shaped palette okay so this brand is vegan it's cruelty free and of course you have the different color schemes I have to say the purple one and the blue one are so so beautiful they could also look super beautiful in a quad you know and then together with the one that has the black and the lighter purple shimmer then we have already a six pen palette and then I would buy it. <laughs> yeah, so in any case, a two pen palette is just really impossible for me. So I would have to pick up at least three at least you know but do whatever you want of course you can pick up more also the outer packaging is really really cool uh, they are they just have it going they have a super super cool vibe to their brand and are always special and different and really really cool all right sweeties then let's also talk about beauty by meek cosmetics that is also a new brand for me and this actually got sent to me on dm by one of you and i'm so so grateful because i did not know this brand existed so they're coming out with this palette eight beautiful neon colors one glitter shade this is the disco palette and this is in stock now in case you want to check this one out from beauty by meek cosmetics okay you do have of course here very very neony shades which um i it's hard for me to work with neons they just do not want to agree with me you know but I've also not tried every single formula that is out there so I might be surprised you know overall it's nice that there are also like darker neon shades like the blue and the purple in the top row that is really really nice and uh, that is what it is so this it looks like a very very fun palette it has a nice balance to it so in case you want to check this one out then definitely do so and have some fun and go and dance <laughs> All right, sweeties. Now let us just um, move back to the middle and let's quickly talk a little bit about my brother, give you an update. I should also really update you on how things are going with Rex, right? But maybe I should do another kitchen floor video and just show him to you because he is today, which is your yesterday. He is four months old. I think I told you beforehand in one of my previous videos that he is four months old already, but I was wrong. I checked on the calendar and now today, basically your yesterday, he's four months old. He has has tripled in size <laughs> and uh, yeah and doubled in weight and uh, he's beautiful he's beautiful he is growing into a bit of a more grown-up fur now which is really really cool because of course the the color of the fur is changing uh, when they grow up and I'm uh, super much in love and he is my most favorite Thing in the world right now you know just saying so maybe i'm going to show him to you in one of my upcoming videos so beyond that of course let's also talk about my brother in ukraine he is doing okay actually uh, right now your yesterday he had a bit of a break together with his wife they went to poland not really for a vacation but it turned out to be like a three-day break 
for them, which is nice. So one day, of course, they had to travel from central Ukraine to Poland. They had one day in Poland and then the third day they traveled back. Okay, so why did they go to Poland? First of all, they kind of needed a break because you cannot be in a situation like this and taking care of so many people and being responsible for such an operation and not ever have a break. Now, is it hard to leave your whole everything behind and go away for three days? Absolutely, because you never know what will happen in those days, right? But they had to go. It was not really, um, it was not really a vacation. They met someone in Poland who delivered salt to them because there is no salt available anywhere there. They had to drive almost uh, 180 kilometers to even get to a gas station. I don't know how much that is in miles. I might have to put it here on the screen. Uh, they drove 180 kilometers to even get to a gas station where there was actually gas available for the car. You know, this is how the situation is. And they need salt for the bakery, you know, so they cannot uh, run the bakery without having salt. They do have grain and all of these things. They have yeast and whatever they need, but salt can't buy it anywhere. So they had to go to Poland to get salt. Okay, so they got, I don't know how, how many kilos, like huge sacks of salt they got, but someone from Germany arranged it for them and drove basically to uh, the central central Poland. And basically they met in the middle, kind of, you know? So that was good. And um, I spoke with my brother while he was there in Poland and he was a completely different person. He was like, this is so, so wonderful to not have the sirens blaring and, and all of that and to just be taken out, being removed from this whole situation just to get a breather, it is just so, so good for them. Now, they're also looking forward to going back. They're going back into this war zone and of course that is, is hard, but they're looking forward to it because they know that this is their place. Okay, beyond that, everything is kind of going okay. They're still looking for people though who can reliably work in the stables. Um, they have, I think, two or three people working there on like a trial basis right now and then they'll see what happens. Bakery is running full speed and everything is going according to the normal <laughs> the normal rhythm. The whole house is full of refugees, which is 20. That is the maximum that they can take. And maybe you also remember a couple of weeks ago, I told you about this very, very old man who had been abandoned by his family. I think he's like 80 plus. His name is Constantine, as far as I remember. And he was really, really grumpy and re really irritable in the very beginning. But he has now started to become like the coolest person that is there on the farm because he has started to like make, make preserves for, for the next winter and, and things like this. So he's becoming really productive and coming up with stuff that he can do and that is so so good for him and of course also it helps them to get through the next winter because who knows what the situation will be then right so that is that um i think a grandchild of one of the people who's working in the stables has been drafted so they were trying to get a bulletproof vest for that uh, young person i think he's only 18 years old so it's really really heartbreaking i don't know if they got one they were trying i don't know if they got a bulletproof vest um yeah, but that is basically what it is. In case you want to keep supporting my brother's work in Ukraine, the link for his PayPal is, of course, in the description box, as it is in all my videos right now. Beyond that, of course, yeah, check out my channel in case you wish to do so. I would love to have you here. Check out my description box. I have all kinds of discount codes with different brands in case you wish to support my channel that way. And beyond that, of course, check out also my social media and, of course, also Rex's social media. Right now, when I'm filming this, he has already 20 followers. <laughs> so proud of my dog. Yeah, but that is what it is. I shall see you here super soon for my next video. And of course, don't forget to drop a comment in the comment section. I would love to hear from you. And I shall see you here super soon for my next video. And up until then, definitely go ahead and sparkle. Hugs and kisses. Bye.